Good evening to you. Thanks for joining us for Wave 31 News at 6. I'm Nikhil Williams. And I'm Dan Schaefer. Six seconds. That's all it took for Decatur police to confront, shoot, and kill Steve Perkins on September 29th. In a news conference today, the Perkins family attorney announced a civil rights lawsuit against the city of Decatur and others. They also named the four officers who are responsible or alleged to be responsible for his death. We're going to look at what this lawsuit could look like. But first, we're going to wait through to one's Paige Meyer, who's been digging for information on these four cops, on their history all day long. Paige. Dan Nickel, the Perkins family lawsuit reveals the names of the four officers they say are responsible for Steve Perkins' death. Now, I did reach out to Decatur Police today to confirm whether those officers were the same ones involved in the September 29th shooting. However, they did not confirm with us whether those were the same ones. Now, if you take a look at your screen here, these are the four officers named in the lawsuit. Bailey McMarquette, Christopher McAdam, Joey Williams, and Vance Summers. The suit alleges these officers violated Perkins' federal civil rights. Now, according to Decatur PD's Facebook, Officer Williams and Marquette graduated from the Alabama Criminal Justice Police Academy together in April of 2021. And Marquette was given the Medal of Commendation just two months ago for his work on equipment that enhances the safety and quality of life of Decatur residents. Now, today I filed a request with the city for background on these four officers. They told me to expect that information by Friday. But if you recall, just last week, three of these officers were terminated and the fourth was suspended. The city gave the officers until Thursday to file an appeal if they wish. Now, the Decatur City Attorney, uh, as of right now, is unaware whether any of those officers have filed a request to appeal this decision. Reporting live in Decatur with coverage you can count on. Paige Meyer, Way 31 News.